everyone. Uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we do have to look at some clutter widgets, such as the container, the column. We also take a look at the maze button. In this video, we are going to take a look at some other widgets, such as the icon button, the list tab, and the list field. So, without much to do, let's get started. Okay, so I'm just going to mention here. I see you have created this the back show banner because first in the material half of my app. So when I refresh this, that's to take away this thing. So I'm going to refresh this. And you can see it's gone now. Okay. So I have some boilerplate already. And you can see I have this my title here and this button here. And then in my scaffold, I have the body of the scaffold, which is this glass. This glass retains a container and then the chart of center. The one I would like to start with is the icon button. So, when you put it in the center of the screen, uh, icon button, it takes a long place. Then an icon. This email icon in the center of my screen. Okay, so you can see how I have this email icon right here in the middle of my screen. And I'm going to print something when I press it. So print press reload. And then when I click this, you can see how I have press down here. So the next with this, I want to talk about this. Uh, let me comment this thing out. The next with it, I would like to talk about this. The list tab. The list tab. Six a title. Let me use a text. I'm calling it list tab title. And then we have a subtitle. Container and the subtitle to part with a height of average and zero and a width average point zero. I'm going to give it a color. Colors of red. I'm going to restart this. Okay, so you can see how we have this sort of a towel in the middle of our screen with the title being on top always then the rest of the body goes into the stuff title now this list that also has some other attributes such as leading leading which will actually determine the widget you want to place in front of this container so i'm just going to go ahead and say circular avatar I'm going to use a color, background color. Color is dot blue. Okay. Then this, you can put anything you want in here. Then this also has a trimming property. I'll also, in this case, I can also decide to put anything in there. But I'm going to put circular avatar. And I'm going to give it the same color. Oh no, I'm going to use a different color. I'm going to use color dot brown. Okay, so I'm going to restart the app. Okay, and you can see, you can see how I have this circular avatar for the blue one. That's the leading, you can see that. That's the one for the leading here in front of the whole thing. And then we have this brown one. Which is the trailing one at the far end. And we can move on quickly to another widget called the list view. Okay. So the list view 
is one way in which it actually helps you to scroll on your screen. Since we started, we have not actually used enough data that we would actually want to scroll by in this tutorial. We're going to use a lot of data so that we can scroll. Then you have to be able to scroll. We're going to use this this view widget. Okay. So to use it, you just buy some this is the child um, the child of something then this is the view okay it takes a list of children and before I come to that it takes a scroll direction so I want to use axis dot vertical so this will determine how you scroll on your screen whether in a vertical direction or in a horizontal direction as you could see the horizontal situation okay so back into the body the body of the list view actually takes a list of widgets which are the children so here what i'm going to do is i'm going to copy all of these that we have done already cut them put them here and then i'll come on them So we have this so far. Now I'm going to duplicate this thing so that we can have enough data to scroll. So I'm going to copy this. I'm going to give this green color, the color in the center. I'm going to make it green. The other one. make this orange deep orange I'm gonna restart this and you can see we have three items in the screen okay I'm gonna copy all of these and I'm gonna restart this and you can see that and we have the ability to scroll up and down So that will be for this tutorial. In the next tutorial, we will talk about the 